Be More Lifestyle. Now, here are your hosts, Shardell Moore and Christina Denny. So many people do not get a second chance, but often wish they did. Yeah, you're right. But with the folks at Second Chance, there's opportunity to renew and reclaim life. Love it. Here to tell us more about this great organization and their exciting event coming up are Mark, oh, not Mark, Pete. We have Pete and Justin <laughs> with us. How are you guys hey, doing? Yeah. Thank, you. Thank you. So, Pete, tell us about Second Chance and the amazing work that you guys do. Well, Second Chance is a nonprofit in Baltimore. Uh, we've been around for about 16 years. Wow. We focus on workforce development, primarily training people in uh, retail, transportation, deconstruction, yeah. and um, it, it, most of all the people that come to us have various barriers to employment. So they may have faced incarceration or right. other struggles to get and keep a job and really just need an opportunity for somebody to believe in them, somebody to, to, to train them and let them succeed themselves. So that's really what we do. We save materials from the landfill through deconstructing, taking apart homes and other structures. So we give materials a second chance, the environment a second chance, and people primarily yeah. a second Speaking chance. Speaking of people, Jessica, tell us your journey with second chance. Um, I'd made a lot of bad life decisions. At the age of 33, I was incarcerated. I was locked up for two years, and when I got home, I had applied at several places and was rejected several times. Yeah. Um, second Chance gave me the opportunity to work. I've been promoted a few times. I'm an Gross. assistant manager now. Go and girl. Thanks. I yeah. financed a vehicle. I have my own home, and I started college, so it opened a lot of doors wow. for me. Just incredible. Thanks. So many opportunities. So inspiring. Yeah. 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 So, Pete, you mentioned deconstruction, and mm -hmm. you kind of briefly got at what that is, mm -hmm. but give us a little bit more details as to how that works. Deconstructing is basically unbuilding rather than constructing. We're gotcha. taking the buildings and structures apart. People will donate them to us. They receive a, a sizable tax benefit from doing that because we treat it like a living classroom. Ah. So we're taking guys out there, and we're teaching them how to salvage every part of the home that we can, anything that can be recycled, saved. Uh, we, we take that back to our 200,000 square foot retail facility across from Horseshoe Casino. Just and a small little just place. Just a small little place. <laughs> and we bundle that up with other goods that are donated to us from the public and, and sell that there. That's yeah. amazing. Yeah. You got a cool event coming up, right? We do. Yeah, yeah. Records Ball. Yeah. yeah. You'll, you'll, you'll hear from people like Jess at the Records Ball. We're a social enterprise, so we try to fund ourselves the best we can. but. Mm -hmm. Uh, we're, we want to grow. We want to help more and more people. So we're doing some fundraising, and this is our signature event. It's a con very fun, very casual, it's construction so cool. chic theme. Oh my gosh, I love kind of these words. Awesome. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. And there's no clear definition of what construction chic means. So you can just have fun. I wore an orange cone on my head last year. Oh, I love it. It was great. Silent auction, all you can eat for Mission Barbecue, great bar, live band, That's dancing, so cool. raffles. It's, it's going to be a blast. Dang. Go That's online. Exactly. SecondChanceInc.org, get tickets. Love to see you Saturday. Oh, we can also wonderful. make a donation too, right? Absolutely. Okay. Yep. If you went to our website, you could do that as well. We'd be very appreciative. And are you accepting just monetary donations, or do you also accept donations in the form of like furniture and things like that? How does that work? So Monday through seven days a week, you can bring donations down from eight four or nine to five, and we take everything: couches, chairs, doors. Our stock is amazing. We get some of the most <laughs> antique things that you would. I got my dad a coffee maker from the 1930s for oh, the second chance. Oh, wow. Like a coffee grinder. It was really so cool, cool, so you never know what you're going to find there. Oh, a lot of nice stuff, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's so cool. Yeah. So, how can people get involved if you want to get involved or help out? Mm -hmm. um, if you want to volunteer with you guys, how do we do that? Yeah, um, secondchanceinc.org. Again, the main, main place to go, there's a tab for volunteering, a tab for donating. If you want us to come pick up your gently used furniture or That's other handy. household yes. items, we can, we can do that through there. Um, you can donate financially through the website. Find all our social media channels. Guys, follow us, please. Yes, We, we please. love to interact. We love to see our products in people's homes yeah. and how other people have reused things and repurposed them because we're, we're all about being creative and giving back. You guys are Absolutely. awesome. Yeah. And you know what? We're human, so we all go through things. So yeah. thank Absolutely. you, you know, for allowing people to have a second chance. So Absolutely. important. Yes, we what need it. What a great organization. Yes. yes. Mm -hmm. And that ball, oh my gosh. That looks, oh my gosh. We I want to go. go. I already have my outfit planned out in my head. <laughs> <laughs> thank you Absolutely. guys so much. Thank, thank you all for having us. Of Appreciate course. It. <laughs>